Good morning, Campus View. As we end our online worship this morning, let us close with an encouragement and a blessing from the scriptures. It's a joyous season. Joy is important to us as believers. Joy is all around us if we look for it. Joy is the second item mentioned in the list identifying fruit of the Spirit. We should expect to see joy, even in dark times. James tells us that Christians count joy even in their trials. Paul and Silas were able to find joy in chains in a dark prison in Philippi. There's a familiar passage in Luke, the second chapter, that speaks to joy for all of us, starting in verse 8. And there were in the same country shepherds abiding in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone round about them, and they were sore afraid. And the angel said to them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, who is Christ the Lord. And this shall be a sign unto you. You shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of heavenly hosts, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, goodwill towards men. Let us look to a new week, confident in the great joy that we know in Jesus. Let us live in peace, sharing joy and goodwill. Amen.